barbaric solstice was to it, but I wouldn't recommend it to a drunken crowd at a sailing club. Oh, well then, that this is where you get them. For not making a recommendation. <laughs> <laughs> the fire is a good recommendation, but yeah. burning an effigy is Guy Fox Day. That's November. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay, so there's a special day for that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Who's it's Guy Fox? Well, it's the guy who tried to blow up the British Parliament. He's a traitor to the British Crown and he oh, yeah. burned at the stake for But he, he's the one we have fireworks after because he set these explosives under the British Parliament when it was a new thing. Oh, okay. Well. So, there you go. Now you have something to say you're Yeah, for sure. So, do you have nothing to do with the solstice. So, uh, are, are you uh, like a Wiccan or uh, like no, I'm a pagan? I'm an. Or just spiritual? I'm an agnostic, agnostic? that we attribute a lot of our spiritual rituals to very ancient uh, cycles and, mm -hmm. and rhythms of the earth and so on. So, mm -hmm. so I respect yeah. these things, right? Oh, yeah. And I do the winter solstice to fall back to sun. Mm -hmm. And a bonfire at the summer solstice is to, is to keep the sun from going away. Oh, okay. I see. It's something to do with working <laughs> anybody. Yeah, yeah. It's just about... <laughs> and the other thing is, you're not allowed to have an open fire in front of anywhere unless you're cooking something. So we should have nice ones. Well, we were cooking the effigy. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> It, it was, yeah, yeah, oh. whoever you don't like, apparently, that was the, uh... Hi, Stephen Harper. It was a scapegoat, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it is a scapegoat ritual. Uh, no? It is a scapegoat, it's a scapegoat associated with the solstice. Oh, well, not the solstice, but I mean, like, this particular, uh, it's the equivalent of... Woo! You're just muddling our rituals here. Yeah, it's true. <laughs>